Well, hello again, YouTube. Uh, this is Ian back here with another unboxing and quick look here. So this is a Logitech C270 HD webcam. It says it can do HD video calls. Uh, it has 720p resolution at 30 frames per second. And this gives you a little bit more information. So it's got a flexible webcam that goes beyond built in. And then it gives you some of the stats on the back here. So let's see what we got. So it does have HD, widescreen, HD, 720p uh, video calls, built-in noise-reducing mic. And then it gives you some of the information on uh, different models. So they have the lower-end models, and then this one is, I guess, the high end of the low end. 60-degree <laughs> uh, field of view, and has video quality of one dot. So I guess there are some other ones that are better than this. Oh, no, I'm sorry. So C320 is a nicer version, and C525 is a nicer version. Anyway, so let's go ahead and open this up and see what we get. All right, so we open the box here, and you get the camera right up front, right up here. You get the instructions here. Let's pull this bad boy out. I should have been more prepared for this, but I'm not. All right, so we got our instructions. Let's see how this... All right, so it does swivel up and down, and then it shows you how to plug it in. And these are pretty simple, it looks like. So, yeah, very simple instructions, not much to it. Let's go ahead and really pull this out of the box. Okay. Not quite the easiest box to open there. <laughs> so it comes in here wrapped up, uh, very small. You got your USB A port that it goes into here, so that's nice. Um, and what else is included in the box? It seems like such a big box for such a small camera. <laughs> wow, that's literally it. Okay, this is very wasteful packaging. <laughs> wow. What a waste for such a small thing. All right, so let me go ahead and hook this bad boy up and then uh, we will see how the installation process looks. All right, so here's my temporary installation place. So my one monitor is very thin and it's kind of hard to stick it on here, but this one is a little bit thicker. So it has a, it has a much easier time. And basically you have it like here and then you wanna put the edge of it to the edge of the screen and then you place the back here against it so it'll stay. Now when you do it on here, it's a little bit harder because there's not much left, and plus my cord is a little short. So I, I have used another webcam before um, from a, one of my friend's Logitech webcams, and it had a much longer cord, so this is uh, kind of short. All right, so let's try this. Uh, let's see what it'll say. Yeah, and it does swivel up and down like the instructions said. All right. Okay, and so this is how it looks so far right now, and uh, I will fix that later. Um, let's see. All right, so let's go to the camera settings and see how that looks. All right. Now, I don't have any in anything installed. I'm using Windows 10, and I'm just gonna use the camera app that comes with Windows 10, and it should pop up and just show me just fine. Let's see if it works. Bam, look at that. So that's not too bad. That's not too bad. Oh, hang on, my cat wants to leave. You wanna leave? Why do you wanna leave? What did I do? Yeah, you wanna go? Okay, bye-bye. Yeah, you know, that's what, that's what cats do. They like to come in and leave and do their thing. All right, so <clears throat> we are back and here's how it looks. Uh, so it looks pretty good uh, from what I can see. 720p isn't too bad. Um, I'm not really a fan of my face right now, but <laughs> this is just to give you an example of how everything looks here. So uh, it does have a little green light to let you know that it's on, which is nice. Um, and then it works with the default camera app, and uh, I believe you can get some software for from Logitech. You know, while we're here, oh, it does, okay. So we have a website here 
logitech.com slash support slash C270. So let's see, let's see if there's any, uh, any drivers for this, anything specific that it needs. All right, so we'll go to logitech.com slash support slash C270 and enter. Let's see what we got. All right, so you can register your product, get started, FAQ, downloads, warranty, specs, contact us if you're having issues. Okay, so it does have pictures of the uh, of the camera. Oh, this looks probably better than the, ca than the video that I'm taking of it right now. So right here you can see that's the edge that you want against your uh, computer, your monitor. And then this piece has a little rubber piece at the end where you can put it against the back of your monitor. So, okay, I'm not sure why they would have one for their laptop, but hey, you know, maybe maybe just a bad laptop screen, but anyway, that gives you an idea here. Let's see what they got as far as downloads. Okay, so you get Logitech webcam software lets you capture your own photos and videos with uh, adjust your camera settings, activate motion detection, and use face tracking with preferred video calling software. If you want to take advantage of the new Windows 8 interface, look for the Logitech camera controller available in the Windows 8 store. Okay, uh, so it's very small. This came out in 2012, wow, okay. This camera must be kind of old, I didn't realize that. All right, well, we can uh, go ahead and download that, why not? Go ahead and do that. 70 something megabytes, not too shabby, all right. All right, so it's extracting its stuff. Now what's great is that you can just plug it into USB and it'll work with your camera app on Windows 10. Um, now other versions of Windows may require the driver, but let's see, well, this is typical old Logitech here. So thank you for your purchase. Let's get started English next. Okay. Please plug your webcam in. Okay, yeah, it's already plugged in. And we'll hit next. All right, so it does have motion detection and the webcam software and the webcam drivers and it'll install here. Let's go ahead and select that. Okay. All right, so it gives you little easy share buttons to share to Facebook and YouTube. So that's kind of interesting. Now the reason I purchased mine is because um, I take tests sometimes for school and with the proctoring, the proctored tests, you have to have a webcam so they can see you when you're doing your test. So that's the reason I got this webcam. Oh, there I am. <laughs> Check settings, okay. So it's using the microphone on it, and it's using the webcam. And uh, let's see, does it actually hear me? Do you hear me, hear me, hear me, yes. Okay, yeah, I can hear me. All right, so we'll hit next. Software installed. Check out my webcam. Okay, interesting. All right, so we'll go ahead and click out the browser here. All right, so you can make a video call or do more. Now, what is this motion detection, just out of curiosity here? Motion videos, controls, motion sensitivity. Okay, that's kind of interesting. So you can have this on and have it have timestamp it. Okay, that's kind of interesting. That's very interesting. I'll have to try that out later. Okay, that's kind of cool. So if someone is in your office or in your room, you can have it do motion detection. It'll take a little video of the person near your computer if they're trying to get into your stuff. That's pretty interesting. All right, so we can do a quick capture here. All right, so this is using your built-in thing, so let's try a picture. Mm. Oh, that looks bad. Not a fan, not a fan. Oh, that looks so bad. We will delete that. 
but that's nice. You got some quick, quick sharing toggles here for your Twitter, Facebook, and YouTube when you do take a picture. All right, so we'll go back to the main, main menu here. So that's that's pretty nice. So, um, very small program and uh, motion capture. That's pretty cool. Um, quick capture and then your webcam gallery that you can share across your social media if you wanted to use this. Um, now this is from 2012, so I'm not sure how updated it is, but um, as far as I can tell, looks pretty good. So uh, this is just a quick look at the Logitech C270 webcam, and I'm sorry for my camera not getting very good here. Not getting very good. There we go, sorta of, kinda of here, yeah. So it is a 720p on there, and it does have like a little shiny plate on the front with Logi on there. And um, I will also take a quick webcam video to include at the end of this, so you can see what it looks like. Alrighty, here is a test of the Logitech C270 camera. And uh, this is using the camera app in Windows 10, and I will do another clip just to see if there's any difference uh, when using the Logitech software versus um, just the camera software in Windows 10. So it looks pretty good. You can see everything on me here. Uh, you do have the tilting function, so maybe I'll show you that. So if you tilt it up, you can tilt it down. Tilting pretty good. All right. All right, hey there guys. So this is a clip being recorded using the webcam software from Logitech. So from the website that I showed in the previous portion of my video, the logitech.com slash support slash C270. And uh, it looks like it has a wider field of view versus the um, Windows 10 camera software that comes with the, that comes with the operating system. So um, again, it looks pretty good. Uh, I don't see any issues with it here. And uh, maybe we'll see if there's a difference with the microphone quality as well. Uh, so this is just going to test using the Logitech software. Okay, just back for one uh, quick final note. So what I noticed is when you save a video on Windows 10 using the camera app, it saves it as an MP4. When you save it using the webcam app on from Logitech, it saves it as WMV, so Windows Media File. Um, I have not tried this on a Mac, but on a Mac you would have to uh, convert it to use it or to watch it. Um, I don't think QuickTime will show it. Uh, so this is one quick note. Um, as I leave here, and uh, hopefully this helped you um, in uh, taking a look at this webcam, and if you wanted to buy it, uh, I paid 20 bucks for mine off Amazon, and I'll leave a link in the description down below if you wanted to take a look at that on Amazon, and uh, thank you for watching.